What's up guys, Lou here back with another video and today I truly have no idea what is inside of this box. Yes, it's yellow. It says Asian, Asian, but I don't, if I had a guess, I would say it's some sort of selection of foreign goods. Is there anything more descriptive? No. Asian mall, Asian box, Asian with an E. Get with the times. Let's, I, let's figure it out together. Could be exciting. Could be a disaster. That's the beauty of it. Ooh, wrapped up all beautifully. This butterfly is everywhere. Make hearts flutter. Is that what we're doing here? Oh my goodness. These are foreign snacks. This is what I've always wanted. We, oh. Some random, looks kind of like a cookie. Oh, mm, yeah, yep. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Product of Japan, Japanese fans. If you're in Japan, do it up. How about this little guy? Pretty little panda guy there. Oh, cool. If you look at the back, it's like a sad panda. It's like a jack panda right there. Oh. Okay. Coconut vibes. Chocolate and coconut vibes. This, I mean, this looks like I gotta make soup or something. And then I turn into some kind of Power Ranger. Where's this one from? Also Japan. How about this? Look 24, dark. Okay, this is probably the scariest thing. So, oh, it's just chocolate. Hmm. Hmm. Green tea cream filled cookies. <laughs> that little guy right there. That's a beauty. Now it's a little weird. Jack, have you ever met a potato snack that you didn't agree with? Jack is so jealous right now. I've never seen him like this before. There's a puddle of drool on the floor. The guy can't even keep it together right now. Ooh, that's a potato snack right there. Mmm! Mm-hmm. Oh yeah. Nong shim. Get yourself some nong shim while you're at it. This cat guy is a big deal in Japan. Did you know that? It kind of smells like cereal a little bit. It's like chocolate covered corn pops. Do kids eat this for breakfast in Japan? I mean, that's unbelievable. Oh, you get the sticker of the dude as well. Whole cut potato crisps, kicked up by the soy sauce. That is a dried out McDonald's french fry. Look at that. I'm like, if it fell between the seats in your car, that's what it would taste like. This, I've had this before. Got the dried out seaweed. Pico Crunch Milk Candy. It's like a hard candy. Oh, it crunch, it's soft inside. Hmm, hmm, mm hmm, hmm, mm hmm, mm hmm, mm hmm. Caramel macchiato in a, what do I do with that? This is Japanese Starbucks right here. Oh. It's caramel macchiato. It's pretty good. Mmm, mm-hmm. It's like a sweetened rice cracker. And that's the name of it. I'm sure some people out there know this. That might be my favorite thing here. The watering kiss mint. Is it gum? It's gotta be gum, I don't swallow. Oh, that's like a fruity gum though, amplified. I've had high chew before, but not banana. Banana? Mmm, mmm. It's like a starburst, but the texture's a little bit chewier. All right, last thing I haven't tried. We got the spicy noodle soup. How spicy? Let's find out. Mm-hmm. Spicy, Japanese, what more do I need to know? Mmm, mmm, oh yeah, that is spicy. Mmm, that's, whoo, 
Unbelievable. Jack is so jealous right now. Dude tries to make everything spicy. He tries to make a peanut butter sandwich spicy. This is a step up on Mr. Noodle. What can I say? Thank you, Japan. Korea. One love.